I'm a first year student at McMaster. Uh, I study life sciences. I'm also the co-president of the McMaster Womanists with my dear friend Sarah Saudi. We focus on feminist work, gender-based violence, anti-blackness, Islamophobia, really things that apply in the context of Canada. And we um, address them through protests, rallies, workshops, talking about the different kinds of um, racism in Hamilton and kind of working as a community on trying to fix that. In high school, Muslims have to advocate for themselves in whatever capacity that is. Um, when I was in high school, we fought really hard for prayer space. We fought really hard to get uh, people to recognize Islamophobia in our schools, perpetrated by teachers and students. And so our experiences navigating the education system as Muslims is that we don't have the accommodations that we needed, and also our feelings weren't as valid. But like we organized as a community, it took a really long and involved process of ensuring that there was appropriate um, uh, teacher supervision, which really has never happened before. And again, speaks to like an implicit form of Islamophobia that we experienced, that they had to supervise us while we were praying. A lot of non-Muslims supported us, actually. We had our Muslim Student Association, and a lot of allies kind of joined, and they came to our meetings, they were in our group chats. That was really helpful. To me, showing solidarity is not just verbally supporting things, but also coupling that with action. Um, a lot of people are really understanding of what we're going through, and they understand Islamophobia. We just need them to kind of help us with that process, because it exists in our schools, it exists in the education system. We just need people to stand with us 